It was four years ago in August 2019, I gave a talk in Klantan, where mashallah in Malaysia, where more than 100,000 people came in that stadium. And it was so successful that the enemies of Islam in Malaysia could not digest the popularity and the impact. So they started maligning me. Some of the non-Muslims in Malaysia, especially those of the Indian origin, they started maligning me. They started criticizing me. They started calling me a terrorist. What I did, the five main important people who maligned me, all of them are politicians. One of them was a cabinet minister of human resources. One was the deputy chief minister number two of Penang state in Malaysia. One was a member of parliament, very popular person. And the other two, they were member of legislative assembly. When they maligned me, I picked these top five people who were involved in maligning me and I filed a case against them. That was four years back. In August 2019. And they were wondering, when we speak about the Prime Minister of Malaysia, one of them is complaining. No one complains, who is this foreigner coming in a country and doing a case against us? Most of them, they came and apologized and did outside court settlement. I said, no problem. But the biggest enemy of Islam, his name is P. Ramaswamy. I continued the case with him. And the verdict was on the 2nd of November, just three days before. I could not attend the verdict because I was called by the Sultan of Sakoto and my talk was I could not cancel it. But just before the talk, a couple of hours before, the verdict came by the High Court of Malaysia that they asked Ramaswamy, P. Ramaswamy, who was at that time the Deputy Chief Minister too of Penang, to pay a fine, to pay damages to me of 1.52 million ringgit which if you convert it to US dollars, it is 320,000 US dollars. And if you convert it to Naira, at that time the rate was 1,200 Naira per dollar, it came out to be 383 million Naira. And the court told he should give this fine within 30 days. And when I got this information, I pledged this complete amount of 1.52 million ringgit to the Palestinian cause. I have donated this complete amount to Palestinian cause. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept this humble purport from my side to the Palestinian cause. And I pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that may he give steadfastness to the people of Palestine. May he give them sabr. May he elevate them. And may he remove the suffering. And may he give the strength of the Ummah to join together to see to it that they are able to stop this genocide in Palestine. And I pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that may he give the martyrs of Palestine Jannah inshallah Jannah Firdos.